Uh, I'm Josephine O'Byrne and I'm here this week as warden for the Anoiga Hostel in Glenmalore. The hostel has been here from 1956. Now this hostel is at the end of a valley, Glenmalore Valley, and we have no electricity, no running water, and we want to keep it like that. It was a very historic house, we had a lot of people lived here in the early part of the century, which is when the house was built, but about 1900. We had Maud gone, Kathleen Lynn, who gave us the hospital. She was a doctor in Dublin and gave it to us basically for the Dublin children to come out for weekends and holidays in the summertime. We also had Yates and Singh used to come down and in summertime to the hostel on weekends and do a lot on their writing and different things. So we run the hostel, we have uh, with all volunteers, so we're we're not paid workers, we all come down because we love the place and the work that's done here is all done voluntary. We have a wood burning stove which heats the place and mostly candles and gas lamps. Our kitchen we have we have one cooker and two hops and a fridge. So how do we have a fridge and no electricity? It's gas. Everything is more gas. We're open from June till beginning of September, the first week in September. Uh, in winter we open Fridays and Saturdays for weekends just only. Mostly walkers. Well the main use would be Lugnaquilla, which is the tallest mountain in Wicklow and we're right at the foot of that. So the, a lot of walkers will go up and walk around and stay, take it so that they can get the early morning, especially in the winter time. A lot of foreigners that are doing the Wicklow way will hike out of their way because it's a, an extra nearly four, four miles from where the way is. And they come up here purely to stay in this no electricity, no water. They just love it to be going back in time. If somebody wants to stay here, the best thing for them would be to contact on OIGA's head office in Mountjoy Square. Or we're on the internet and we actually have a Facebook page as well. Or if they wanted to just book through one of the other hosteling um, agencies like Hostel Word or some of those other groups, they have contacts with us here.